Today I'll be unboxing the Pure Lure Silver Feather. Hello everyone, this is Ricardo de Vue. So the box is already only with a crap in it, so explosion diagram on Chinese and instructions how to use a bait caster. They will give you this nice neoprene a real sleeve with it. And if we take it out of the sleeve, here it is the pure lure silver feather. You see the knobs, the handle, the finish on the handle is amazing. And going on the specs, so the silver feather features a max drag braking power of 4 kilos or around 8 something 9 pounds. It has 11 plus 1 ball bearings, all of them stainless steel, all of them shielded. It weighs 119 grams or so they say, I weighed mine and it weighed 120 grams on two scales. So my kitchen and my drug scales both said it weighed 120 grams, but I also weighed the spool and they say it's 4 grams and mine weighed 3.9 grams, which is less. I prefer that than the 1 gram on the overall weight. Mine it's the 60 Air AG, so it's 7 to 5 to 1 gear ratio. It will retrieve uh, 65 centimeters of line. They also feature a higher gear version. So the 60 AOR XG, so that one it's 8 5 to 1 gear ratio. It will wind 74 centimeters per turn. And I don't know if I told you, they have the best page on all AliExpress in detail of the product. In there you can find that they recommend the lure that you throw the weight, so 1 to 10 grams. They recommend the line that you should be running on this reel, so they recommend 0.6 to 1 PE, so braided line. And uh, the rest of the things are on the reel. It features a tapered guide, they have uh, NMB bearings on the main gear. The gears are as usual made from aluminium and manganese brass. It has all the bells and whistles that you should expect because this reel is not cheap. The normal price is three times the usual budget that I use. Uh, you could get it on a choice day sometimes with all the discount stacking, so Aliexpress overall discount, store coupon, and I think coins also, and you can get it from 119 euros, 119 euros to 297 or something like that. And that breaks the rules of the channel, but I got it for a specific reason. A reason. There are a lot of rods claiming under one gram casting capability and I needed something that should be able to do it. Uh, after $100 you have to go to the Comorant, the Kingfisher FF01 and that's $250 for a reel that I cannot uh, have warranty on Portugal consistently. So it's an Aliexpress item, you know what you're dealing with. But continuing on with the reel, I will give you a closer look of the internals. So this is the magnets, a little bit different from the Valiant Eagle. The Valiant Eagle, you can see the individual magnets and they stick out a little bit more. This one, it's a full ring of magnets. This is the AEM braking system. They call it Adaptive Brake Module Motion Trajectory. I don't know why it says AIM, it's what is on their page. And this is the spool with NMB bearing on it. It's 28 millimeters on diameter and 22.6 millimeters wide. Without the bearing and the, and the shaft, this spool only weighs 2.3 grams, which is crazy. It's very, very light and it's not even ported. And also the handle 
it's it has a very 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 nice and smooth finish it's not as aggressive as some other carbon handles with with sharp corners and this is all that you need to know about this reel the other thing that most of people that i asked about this reel if i should get it uh, yep fishing and some facebook group that i'm now in about bfs they say that this reel is very deceiving on the beginning so what they mean is that the it, it doesn't freeze pull very nice it, it if i try to freeze, freeze pull it it will not move a lot it, it I, I cannot show you because the spool is black but it doesn't spool very nice but out of the box you should break it in with heavy lures and after some point you fill it and you'll be casting one lure grams with no problems and now for the sound test drag adjustment the drag sound it's perfect it's the type of drag sound that i really like and now the this is the spool tension knob also clicky and this is the trigger also very very nice the fitting fishing finish on the reel it's very very good you don't feel any sort of uh, bending i know that under load, load will be different but even though it's 120 grams you have a full reel seat not like the sambo air where you have a split in here to save weight this has a full reel seat um i'm eager to test it I will test it on the probably on the next week. Whoa! Whoa, this jet was amazing! The fish just jumps in on the lure! It's the first whoa! I missed it! No! And I will see how it will perform because I have the illusion slash casting version on the way and I'm eager to go with and don't have to use my ultralight gear when I don't want to use my ultralight gear to cast Tanta on micro jigs but until then I will see you guys next time bye